Lorna Gray was born Virginia Pound in Grand Rapids, Michigan. She came to Hollywood in 1937 and she played bit roles up until 1938 when she played the heroine for John Wayne's B Western film Red River Range for Republic Pictures. Columbia Pictures signed her as a leading lady for the Foreign Legion B film Adventure in Sahara, followed by many of Columbia's B Westerns, mysteries, horror films, including The Man They Could Not Hang with Boris Karloff, and comedy shorts with the Three Stooges, like Three Sappy People. Her first serial was Columbia's Flying G-Men. Her second serial was 1940's Deadwood Dick. When her contract was up at Columbia, she started working with other studios on films like Tocito Junction for Republic. In 1942, she took on the role of Volturra in the serial perils of Nyoka. She found some small parts and a few features, but returned to the serials with 1943's Captain America. After a few more features, she made her fifth serial, Federal Operator 99, in 1945. That year, she was signed to a contract for Republic Pictures. They changed her name to Adrian Booth. She was cast in her last serial, Daughter of Don Q, in 1946 under this name. She was paired with Monte Hale for a series of B-Westerns from 1946 to 1947. She moved into some A-list Westerns, including The Gallant Legion with William Elliott and Brimstone with Rod Cameron and Walter Brennan. She retired from acting in 1951. She partnered with Jane Russell to found the adoption agency, the World Adoption International Fund, in 1952. As Adrienne Booth, she won the Golden Boot Award in 1998. She continued to attend film festivals up into her 90s. She passed away in spring of 2017. And we'll be right back after a word from our sponsors.